Hey y'all, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is your girl Monique Nicole. This is your first time tuning in. Make sure you stop what you're doing and you press that subscribe button. Also, make sure you click that bell for that notification link. So I do want to say happy holidays for whenever, you know, happy holidays. Hanukkah, you know, Kwanzaa. You already know. Today, I have a great stocking stuffer. So before we even get into this, let me tell y'all something. So I'm like, my birthday is coming up on December 21st and I'm gonna be a double digit. I'm gonna be 33. So I just wanna say thank you all for just tuning in to me for another year, dealing with all of my shenanigans, loving my crazy hairstyles, my fantasy face paint looks cause I will be dropping some. So stay tuned. But if y'all wanna help me celebrate my birthday, you wanna show your girl some love, you can always like, share and subscribe this video. Also, you can also just continue to support me so that I can continue to, you know, put my talent out there, get the supplies that I need to drop these looks, and just bless my Cash App or my Zelle or my PayPal, only if you want to, but it will be highly, highly appreciated. So, let's get into it. So, today... I have a Janet collection. Now, y'all know me. I love me a good old Janet collection wig because they definitely have been coming out with the slaves. Now, for the past couple Janet collections, I have been rocking their like blowout line, which I love because it matches my natural 4 texture. But there is this line that I happen to, you know, skip all over. So I was like, you know what? Let me bring it back. Because, you know, there are all these different melted hairlines that are coming out. And Janet Collection has one of their own. Now, I have their melted hairline in the style Jada in the color number one. Now, the color I originally wanted was the M um, B L Y G slash 30. Give me a little, little ya ya, a little highlight at the end. But nothing like a good old classic natural color to set off the holiday spirit. So let's see what Jada is talking about. Is she giving us entanglement? Okay. But we're going to see. So here's the stock card. As you can see, it's advertising. It's really, really pretty color. Y'all know I love to experiment in different colors. And I actually absolutely love that one. So this is like standard boxing. Take it out, cause yeah. Let's get straight to it. Let's see what she looking like. Let's get all this out. All right, let's get the wig cap off, but let me sit it down nicely cause she gonna go right back into it <laughs> once I take this baby off. So here is Jada. Now I'm running my fingers through it and she's not giving me, you know, entanglement. And that's good because, you know, with this long hair, who knows what can happen. So here is the inside of the cap construction. It does come with three cones, one on the right, one on the left, one on the back with two adjustable straps. It has a st standard cap construction with the lace as a middle part. So I love the way how it just blended into my skin tone on my hand. You see, it's not even on my head. Oh my gosh, y'all. Getting so excited. It looks like it comes with some baby hairs. Oh, well, like a lot of baby hairs. And some room to play with the lace. Now, this seems to be a standard middle part. But you know me. You know, whatever your prerogative is, you can both shift it to the right or shift it to the left. So, the luxury on it is nice. It's not too shiny, not too dull. It does have a silky texture to it with a slight yackiness which is what i like so it's not too silky so what i'm gonna do is i'm just gonna go ahead i'm gonna put this baby on and i'm gonna give you my final honest true opinion about miss jada hair all right y'all so i'm back all i did was the little ya 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 you know i just cut off the lace i put some powder foundation actually i put this um powder foundation underneath the lace because i ran out of tinting spray so this works just fine for me. And all I did was put a little spritz, like right here. That's it, okay? Y'all think I'm lying? I'm not. All right, let me show you. Y'all see? It's not secured at all. So my little trick is I just put a little bit of hair behind my ear. 
and I use the baby hair to camouflage. Now what you can do is color this in black. That way it could blend into your hairline more. And yeah, so the lace is air to air. So you will have like a couple, maybe like an inch and a half on the inside uh, so that it can cover, which is really great because you can always cut it. Or if you got a bigger head, girl, you good to go. Girl, guy, you good to go, okay? So this is the parting. Like the parting is nice, but I am going to try to like cover some of the, the knots in this. So I'm just going to take this and i am just gonna make this more like pronounced and i'm gonna rub it in it's completely optional up to you but because my ring light really makes everything so pronounced that you kind of gotta go in and even if you step out you know you want to make sure your wig on point you know even if people know it's a weave you know let them be like oh but her hair look good you know there's always going to be a hater anyway. Now, there's always going to be someone in the back. I ain't even her hair. Bitch, I pay for it. Anyway. And that's what I'm going to do. Now, if y'all are new to my channel. And, yeah. I don't really do too much to baby hairs. I love the wispy look of a baby hair. Now, if you're the type of person who want to trim it, gel it down, swoop it, write your name in cursive, do you. But not for me. I love the carefree wispiness of this. Of the baby hairs. And they're not too thick and they're not too thin. Maybe it's just a little too pronounced. So you might just want to play with it. If you want to use like the straightening comb me uh, method to like melt it down, you definitely can. But I'm not going to do that because I could like use the baby hairs to my liking. So that's all I'm going to do as far as prepping this. All right, y'all. So I have not brushed out the curls yet. As you can see, they still have this tight curls. Um, I am going to brush it out because I want to see how it looks. But once again, this is Jada from Janet Collection. You can definitely check out your favorite online beauty supply store or... I don't know if you can actually go into your um, beauty supply store since it's COVID, but and definitely look for Jada, okay? Because Jada is popping, and I ain't even brush her out yet, okay? But we got it. We gonna get it together. So I'm just gonna start at the bottom because when you have longer units, you start at the bottom and then you work your way up. You know, I'm not gonna like take all the curls out you know because I wanted the curls to not like break apart and then I'm gonna do this side because y'all already know like when it's like a middle part it'd be like one side be one set of curls and then the other side be another set of curls and you just be like all right I'm just gonna make it do what it do so I'm gonna brush this out I feel like I brushed it enough. Now y'all see, I even switched up my lip gloss for y'all. Y'all ain't even now. See? Oh, come on, Jada. Come on. Yes, I'm all, I, yes, I am for it, Jada. Red tabletop, Jada. Yes, come through. What? What? Y'all, I've been so focused, like I said, on a blowout collection, which is phenomenal, by the way, that I need to get, I need to get more of the, this melted collection, okay? And I am. I definitely am. Because she might end up being my birthday wig. She's so pretty. And it's so nice. Like my fingers are going through it. You may get a little at the end. That's to be expected because it is a long wig. Like I said, the texture is really nice. It does have a soft Swiss lace. It is big hair friendly. It is breathable. Even though it has all this hair and it does look a little heavy at the bottom. It is very, very lightweight. And it's definitely a great Christmas gift for anybody or any one of your friends who likes to wear wigs like I do or like you do. Definitely go ahead and get this one. They would not 
be disappointed oh and it feels like bundles like you know sometimes you get wigs and you're like okay it's cute you know but we know the quality right but this feels like bundles this feels like i spent a lot of money to get my hair done like i got a frontal closure and i got some bundles sewn in this good this looks like a good three and a half bundle type of wig you know depending on the density of it but it is so pretty i'm about to go ahead and take some pictures Ugh. so if you want to know how i feel about this yes i also do absolutely do love this wig you definitely should go ahead and get it i do want to just come in so y'all can see what it looks like now i am going to be honest as i do this it does feel a little thin like up here feels a little thin but it's not like i feel like tracks or that i feel like my tracks are going to be exposed it's just to me because there's so much volume at the um, bottom i would prefer maybe like an extra two tracks up here just to create more of a fullness but like i said that's my personal opinion now i am going to give y'all a 360 because this hair is kind of long i would say this is like a good 24 26 inches i am 5 6 so it, it's a good length on me so this is how the hair looks all in the front this is how the hair looks like on the left side this is how the hair looks on in the back. Ugh. Just take a look at this. And this is how the hair looks on the right side. And once again, this is how it looks like this. So definitely keep a paddle brush in handy. Um, I will highly suggest you use some mousse just to kind of tame some of the flyaways. You're not going to need too, too much, but just to tame it a little bit. Because, you know, you know it's Jada. You don't know what she's going to get, but she's going to give it to you. So, y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe this video. Let me know if you already have this wig. What are your thoughts and opinions? Um, I'm, like I said, I'm definitely going to try out the rest of the selection. Um... Hopefully soon, hopefully soon, but so far I am feeling her because she is so god darn gorgeous. So once again, check out Jana Collection. Uh, make sure you check out this style, Jada, on your local online, you know, favorite beauty supply store and definitely get her in your cart. Trust me, you would not be disappointed. And also, like I said, your girl's birthday is coming up. So if you want to share some love and help me celebrate, I will make sure y'all can have the link to my cash app and all that good stuff in the description box below. But until then, stay beautiful. And